how you are doing today. Hope you're keeping safe, staying healthy. I pray that by the time all this is over, we all are going to be alive. To testify of all of this to the glory of Today, God. if you have not subscribed yet and you opportunity to watch this video, please, today, subscribe. we are going to be baking meat pie. Earlier on, about, um, say, three hours ago, I mixed puff puff because we'll be doing puff puff and we'll be doing meat pie. So I mixed puff puff earlier today because um, I'll be having some visitors. So I decided to, you know, go ahead and make this and for my children as well. So um, it took this whole time because, you know, um, I use this particular yeast for my puff puff rising and i don't know why it took this whole time to rise so i have to leave it to really rise because the other time it didn't give me what i wanted so i had to just wait for all this time if i had used the other one i used to which i'm going to show you next time this one i don't really like this yeast so in case you know this yeast please don't buy this yeast so this is my puff puff. I'll be showing you the consistency by the time I want to start frying. So these are my the recipe for my um, meat pie mixture. This is my egg. This is my carrots. This is my um, before I go to the vegetables. This is my dried uh, all purpose floor by the side you can see some um, nutmeg and this is the baking powder this is the egg that will be going for it and uh, this is the butter I like to use so all of this butter will be going to this this is just um, two and a half cup of this particular cup in case you want to know which cup I'm, I'm using for my measurement so here i'll just go ahead and add my uh, baking powder i'll go ahead and add two spoons of baking powder so i think i'll just put half of this more to get me what i want take this out of the way I love cinnamon so much. I love that aroma in my pie. So I want to go ahead and add some cinnamon. So I like some sugar in my baking, in my meat pie mixture. So I'm going to add some sugar just to give it this is uh don't mind the space guys this is just about uh, say three spoons of sugar just to give it a little taste i don't really like sugar in my in most of my food anyway especially meat pie but you know so here is my mix my mix uh Blended, uh, here is my blended, um, uh, what do you call it? Hot uh, scotch, scotch bonnet. I will just go ahead and put it on the on the frying pan because I just want to. This has been, you know, heated up before now. What you have here in it is your um, spring onion. So here I want to go ahead and add all of this. I have my grounded beef here in case you want to know what I have here. I like to use the uh, real beef actually. So I'll mix it up with the other kind of beef I'll show you. 
when I'm doing this. So I'll just go ahead and fry this ginger red, uh, 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 scotch bonnet pepper, just one because I want my meat pie, uh, you know, feeling to be spicy a little bit. So this is one scotch bonnet. Two um, chili green pepper and a little bit of onion because I don't want to chop it you know so I don't want you to see the onion inside some people don't like to see onion inside their food so in this I'll just go ahead and cover it up to start frying while I start doing my, my head and uh, mix this dough, sit it aside and then start um, making the, uh, you know, vegetables that will be going inside the meat pie. So I'm going to mix all of this together. I'll mix all of this together. You want to help me break four eggs. I'll bring down the heat. I'll just bring down the heat. I'll bring down the heat to two. Yeah. Break four eggs for me. Here, yeah, I want to use four eggs for this very, very. Remember, this is my milk. It's all going to be going here. So I'll just go ahead and uh, put my butter. Make sure your butter is from the fridge. Make sure it's from the fridge. You know, you don't want to. I'll do this. Some people would have chopped the butter into uh, some cubes, you know, but I have something here. I'm going to be using this to match the butter together. This will help me to pieces my butter. Yeah. This will help me to ground my butter here until until the consistency I want and then I'll use my hand and do the rest. So I'm gonna put this in the trash Manuela. Oh excuse me. So I'll just do this. I'm supposed to use the five eggs but I want to save costs use one of the egg for you know Placing on the top of my pie by the time I'm done, you know, and I want to start baking. So, here, yeah, I'll just go ahead and use my hand to. You know, Mix on seal. I hope you're seeing what I'm doing, you know, because I want you to really. I told you all this time I'll make me fire, I'll make me fire, but because of time and there's so many things going on, we've not been able to do it. So today. I thank God I have the opportunity. That's why I grab it to make sure I I do this meat pie today. And I mean, I have always wanted to eat meat pie for some time now. And uh, I know everybody in this house feels the same. My husband went out this morning. And then, uh, you know, he's coming.
coming in with some friends so I want to just go ahead and do this and uh, show me some its way so at least by the time they come here they will have something to you know feel good with why they are sitting and gisting okay now I'm going to be adding the egg to this so I will add the egg I'm going to add it to the center I'll just add the egg thank you go ahead and break the other one stay it and keep it for you know the other purpose sorry guys I forgot to put my salt please give me salt a pinch of salt it doesn't matter you can still put it you know I forgot to put my salt a pinch good go ahead baby you want to give me a little bit more a little bit more go ahead thank you some people add water to their meat pie well I don't really like adding water you can see what is giving us guys these things doesn't take you too much to do like I always tell my friends you know people who ask me to teach them I tell them it's all about patience so I'll go ahead and add my milk this milk will serve me as my water I will just be adding the milk little by little until I get the consistency that I am looking in this meat pie mixture. Oh my god, this meat pie is going to be good. I can see, even without you know finishing. Oh lord, this is good. This is good, guys. Oh Lord, this meat pie will be wonderful. See what is giving me. I've not even added all the milk, and it's already giving me more than I expected. The butter and the egg will always help you. Oh Lord, this is the consistency, guys. See the consistency. You don't want to bother it too much you know so this is the consistency so i'm going to wrap it up and put in the fridge for like 15 minutes while i finish up with this so get me uh this stuff to wrap it up and put it in the fridge yeah this will be in the fridge for like 10 minutes Stickies or whatever, so stay tuned. So, here is my grounded beef, which will be going in first. Here, I have the grounded pepper I already showed you guys two chili pepper, one scotch bonnet pepper, um, a four, uh, four cubes of garlic. And then just a little bit of ginger and some onion that's what i have here and the uh, real beef raw beef rather which i grinded so this is the grinded beef you know that comes in the store so i ground to this i fry to this very very uh you know make sure it's all brownish you can see how you can you know that color so I'll be putting all of this grounded beef because I really want to enjoy this pie guys I really want to enjoy this meat pie so I'll just go ahead and you know add some more light fire to this so start giving me <clears throat> so 
so I'll go ahead and add some black pepper to this. I'll add some curry, a little bit of curry. Just a little bit. I'll add some all purpose seasoning to the beef so you can have some good taste and some good aroma. And then I will go ahead and add some thyme. Remember, this is beef, so you want it to give you a good aroma. Yeah, there has to be time in there, but you have to be careful the quantity of time you put. So, I'll go ahead and add my black pepper. Shoot, I added too much mistakenly, but it's okay. And then we start. You know, shredding it into your partner and fry until it's all um, potato because the liquid that is going to come out from here is going to help me cook the potato because I don't want the potato to be too cooked. I want any time I open up the meat pie, everything looks very, very fresh. So that's why I'm gonna I'm gonna by the time this is fried to my to my uh, desired you know uh, want then I will I will make sure I put the potato immediately. I'll let it fry until all of it is brownish. This is your, you know, I can see. Good. your meat pie filling. So, you want it to look good, tasty, and then that will help your meat pie. Oh my God, this is going to be wonderful. This is going to be amazing, super amazing. I will just add up the potato here. Mm. Mm. I want this fried and I don't want water in it. I do not want any water in it, but I promise you it's going to be, it's going to cook right here. It's going to give me what I want. Remember, I did not add water. Remember, guys, I did not add water, but I've been, I'll be mixing the floor with some water. So that will help me to get a very good mixture. I mean, it smells so, so amazing, guys. Oh, Lord. This is smelling really, really nice. I will add some salt here because I just tasted it and I think it needs some salt. And then I will go ahead and add some Maggi seasoning so that it will give me a good taste, you know, from the inside. You don't want it to be watery because Remember, it's going to the, into the meat pie, from the meat pie to the oven. So it's, it's going to bake real good and come out fresh. Mm. 
guys this is super super delicious so i'll add the top of this because i like green capture on this thing capture on this i'll know the heat now This floor to this water. Manuela, get me some more food. And then I'll mix. Most people don't add water, they just spray the floor. No, you don't do that. You have to add the floor in the water, mix it up. That's why I did not add water from the beginning. Call flour if you like, but I like to add flour itself because that will really help you to hold. Yeah. So you mix like so. You mix like so. Mix like so. Until everything is real mixed. And then you add it up to you know. You add it. You gradually add it. See? So you mix gradually. Remember, I did not add water at all. See? See the consistency? See? And everything here is still looking fresh, guys. See how fresh everything here is still looking. You can see your beef fresh. You can see the green peas fresh your carrot fresh see your potato fresh everything here is still looking fresh remember you're going to be putting this in your meat pie so you don't want it to look dead you want everything to still look real fresh and yummy so this is ready, like ready, ready, ready to go into the meat pie, ready to go into the meat pie guys. So this is ready, I'll take this out immediately, see your meat pie, you know filling so we'll be putting some of this because my husband likes this out i'll just do this for him especially along with the meat pie 
So that's it, guys. You let it cool off before you start putting it in your meat pie. So stay with me. Go. So, guys, this is the meat pie dough. Like I told you, I left it like for 15 minutes. Sometimes you can even leave it for more than that, anyway. Um, I want to start, you know. You spray some flour on your table. This is just to help it not to stick each time you roll so you get, you know, I'll just go ahead and do this. Bear with me. I told you guys I just moved to another place and the kitchen is not <laughs> I want to get more than 20 pies from this so you just go ahead and do this <coughs> drop some flour in your pan Some people will use plates, some people will use whatever just to get the shape. But for me, I already know the shape on my head. I know what to do and get a good, you know, shape. But it's fine though. I think I can still, I look at it like it takes just a lot of my time so I really don't want to start doing all that you know but I'll just go ahead and do what I used to do and then let me get the feeling here Manuela so I will just go ahead and this is flour mixed with water just put this at the tip of it so that it doesn't open when I'm closing it, it just goes boom. I don't really want a big size of meat pie like this, so I think I'm going to go ahead and cut the size after this. This would be for taste. These children can't wait to, to eat this meat pie. They are already like, oh, mommy, this is too good. This is too good. You don't need to put too much, oh, me. I like to feel my thing go like this you go like this and then you put this inside the floor and then you do this you do this you do this and just beautify your meat pie like so just like so here you go I think I'll just take a little bit. That's good. Yeah. That's take, good. Take some. Because good. I want to. I don't want it to be all too big. Yeah. Yeah. They're already saying yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I said I don't want it to be too big. They say yeah because they want to make sure. I don't give it to all the friends as big as it is because me, I don't, I don't send you. I'm managing my space like I told you also. All you're doing is just to see how. It's 
space is not big enough for me. You know what? Take this out for me. Take. Just take it out for me. It's not allowing me to. Give it the shape you want. Put it on. Yes. What time? Is it very cute? Very good. Emanuela has set up the oven for me already. You see? That's why you should teach these children. Teach them, and you see, they will learn. Whether they grumble or not, I'm telling you, they will learn. Tomorrow, you will see them doing it for their friends and loved ones, their husband to be. Meat pie is like it's not going to be enough for honestly speaking, man. I'll quickly go ahead and roll my husband's uh, sausage roll. I don't want to have any problem with that. They are already singing the language of I can't wait to eat this. I will buy one.
next time I will just make you guys some fish pie. Oh Lord my God. You are going to enjoy that fish pie. Don't worry. I told you all we have so much to do on this video. We have a lot to give on this very platform. Yeah. I'm trying to be as fast as I can so I won't be able to use all the instruments like you will be expecting me to but I promise you Are you liking this video already? Please like this video. Share it with your friends and loved ones. This made pie, I hope it will, it will be up to 20 as I desire. I hope so, I hope so. Or more than I have to cut down on the sizes. Honestly, guys, it has to be gotten just. Honestly, I really cannot wait for this meat pie to come out from the oven myself. I have been starving, craving for this meat pie. So we have five. Lord, Lord, I wish I would have more than, more than, more than. I want to have up to 20. 20. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I hope you're liking this video. I hope you are liking this video. I'm doing sharply, sharply work. So don't worry. I go cool down and do a mess time. But anyway, is the oven heating up? Yes, it's okay, I read. So, you know, you just go the same way until you get all of it done. So I will show you when I will want to put it in the oven. Stay tuned. So this is what we are able to get. So you just do this. You just cream it with some egg to make sure you get the brown looking meat pie. This is beautiful. Everybody in this house is already dancing. The girls have to do another meat pie dough because they want to make sure they finish this. Are you seeing what is remaining from what I did guys? They want to finish it up so they have gone ahead to mix another one the camera lady says she wants some more so they have gone ahead to this is the sausage roll guys this is the sausage 
for their daddy. He loves, 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 loves sausage. So we'll be going ahead to do another meat pie, which is going to be behind the camera. But this one is ready to get into the oven. So at least I have, like how many? One, two. I have, um, I have 14. Oh, that's good. I was aiming 20. But I have 14. And the, I have 14 meat pies and I have four sausage for my lovely husband you know so i'm happy though so you know i still got enough meat pie to enjoy with my friends and loved ones so it's a beautiful weekend guys it is an amazing weekend make sure you are liking this video please share for those of you who haven't been watching me on this platform please do you will learn so many things as I upload new videos and thank you as you keep watching I'll just take this straight into the oven You just put your oven on 350 and then you put your meat pie to bake. Make sure you are watching your meat pie. Make sure you're watching it. On this, I'm going to put some more so I'm trying to create space. I'll just let it go on until so let's hold on until it comes out thank you so this is the last part of it the second part we made you know my girls did so guys the first part is in the oven already so we are waiting for it to come up so we'll add the second part See how beautiful it's looking. So, we are coming back. So, guys, see the meat, the puff puff, it has risen so much. I hope it will not fall because sometimes when it rises so much, it falls back. Because I left it and I've been doing so much. So much today honestly speaking i hope it gives me what i want because i have been i've left it for too long too long guys too long i mean too long i've left it for too long guys So you can see the consistency of the meat of the puff puff dough. So let's see, you know. So guys, see some of it already. Oh no, this is good. Whoops, take. This is a beautiful meat pie, guys. See the beautiful meat pie. 
this is good so I'm going to change the ouch yeah I managed the space guys that's why I did that so I'm just going to move this way to manage the space anyway. Peter, I want to blow the light for me. So... Oh, I don't know. You want to blow the light. See the power of his red. Your hot of puff is ready, ready, ready. Swing ready, swing ready. Finger press puff is ready. See your puff puff is ready. Like ready, 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 ready. Your puff puff is ready, 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 ready. Amazing puff puff. blessing. Today is a wonderful day. <clears throat> we are already eating up the first badge. <laughs> I'm so happy. Anytime I'm home, my family enjoy themselves. Yeah, this is 
I can't enjoy this alone. My family friends need to come here. I'll make a call now. This is just too much to enjoy alone. Okay. We'll continue, guys. So, my good friends, this is the last part of all we've been doing since this morning. Here is your sunshine meat pie. See how beautiful we almost ate them all. I mean, the sausage. Uh, the sausage was a hot one, so it was quickly, you know, so this is the puff puff. I want to tell you something in case you know what this is. Remember we used to do this back home. This is plantain, spicy plantain with some vegetables in it. See? How beautiful. I just wanted to remind you all of this. We do this for mostly wedding parties. People make their order. If you still remember this, please. Where you use mortar to blend the plantain, you remember? You use blender to crush, not blender, mortar. Back home. So make sure you try this. Hope you are liking this video. <laughs> good. This is really, really good. I want you to take a close look, mostly my Nigerian brothers and sisters. This is plantain. You mash your plantain, put some vegetables in it, put a little bit flour. Oh my god. And then fry like a frying puff puff. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. The meat pie. Oh my god. I think I should just show you one of the meat pie. This is just good. I'm tired of eating. I've been eating all this from the fire. I'm just tired. Please make sure you subscribe. Manuela, can I get a, a plate right here? They are looking so good. Yeah. Just sit it here for me. Man. They are just wonderful. I'm tired of eating, guys. I've been eating this. I almost forgot to show you the last part. Please subscribe. And press on that button. Where you can always see me when I upload. Put it over there for me. Just keep it there for me. I'll eat it later. 
प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल आई डी दिस जॉब विथ मैनुअला She has been eating it from the fire. Um, um, so thank you, um, viewers. This is the result of the meat pie and the puff puff and the plantain, fried plantain. This is good. It's very good. Hope you guys like this video. Thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. This is Gucci's Kitchen. Gucci's Kitchen. African style. Hot spot at Savannah, Savannah Georgia. Georgia. Yes. Thank you very much. God bless you. Thank all. you all for the support. Keep loving and supporting us. God bless you. Thank you. Ciao, ciao.